scenes that prove TV has gone too far. Reality television series are notorious for breaking all ratings and viewership records. The more adventurous one program becomes, the more difficult it is for all subsequent shows to fill the void left by the predecessor. Screenwriters come up with a range of outrageous concepts that would seem insane to the average individual to become even more addicting and earn millions of views, yet not to them, and to think people really watch these programs. Here's some reality programs that have gone too far in terms of ratings. Tor. When it comes to props, Japanese performances have always been among the strangest. This one, Tor, is no exception. And in addition to the typical facts, you get to witness individuals mummified. Well, kind of. When a person doesn't properly answer a question, he or she is wrapped in white fabric. Strange can't even begin to describe it. Solitary. The producers of this program were most likely inspired by the jail's solitary confinement, which is a scary concept in and of itself. The candidates on this program are isolated for many weeks without any human interaction. During this period, individuals must execute a variety of mental activities while getting little to no sleep. This is just fantastic. The Intercept Russians are also well-versed in bizarre games. Contestants in The Intercept are positioned on the wrong side of the law. The participants are deemed hijackers since they drive a stolen automobile. If they can avoid the police for more than 30 minutes, the automobile is theirs. Baggage this is one of those shows that will convince you that mankind is doomed. It's an online dating reality show that airs all of its members' dirty laundry. Each of them must reveal three embarrassing truths about themselves before deciding if they can cope with all this material and really date one another. Among the secrets are, I feed my pet with a spoon at a restaurant and I weep every day. Candy or not candy? It's difficult to see a program such as this one being broadcast in the United States or any other nation other than Japan. The participants are placed in a very bizarre setting and tasked with determining whether or not the items that are around them are made of chocolate. In order to succeed in this task, the contestants must determine whether or not the items around them are made of chocolate. Students are required to sample a wide variety of items, some of which may even include shoes and toilet seats. Naked and Afraid there is some truth to the assertion that the Discovery Channel is an expert in wilderness and survival. The new program Naked and Afraid has two contestants, one male, one female, who are dropped onto an uninhibited island and told to make it through the ordeal without any supplies of food, clothing, or water. Hoarders The reality television series Hoarders gives viewers an inside look into the lives of some of the world's most extreme hoarders. Who's Your Daddy? This program has only given one episode before it was pulled off the air by Fox because the network felt it was inappropriate and humiliating. A lady who had been adopted was locked in a room with 25 men, one of whom turned out to be her original father. She would have won $100,000 if she had correctly identified the culprit.